off, folks. We got the old smoke wagon fired up. It's time to go do some work. Got some new airlines on the trailer over the weekend. This is the airline that me and Bruce fixed. I had another one that was going bad. This brass one here, it wouldn't stop leaking, so we just pulled them off. I'm going to throw them over here for now and haul them off and get rid of them. Do something with them tonight. Get them in the garbage can. What is this? Can't be going down the road with that. Oh, that's the package for the airline. Set it over here with them. Pick it all up tonight because we got to roll. Can move a skid steer and then a 40 ton off road truck. I think I hear a leak. No, they're just airing up. Oh yeah, there's a leak out here. It's supposed to leak there until it's got air. Until it's full. But that's what we did. We put these little rubber things around them. Because they were, you can see where the airlines rubbed here. Rubbed here. It rubbed the hole right in the airline. So that's fixed. Anyway, let's go trucking. Yeah, we're here at the first one. Skid steer, bucket and forks. Then after that, I think we're gonna move a front loader and uh, an off-road truck. So pretty busy day. Thank goodness. Been needing it. But they got the uh, bucket on, so we got to do a swap. We have to take that bucket off. Get these forks on. And uh, doors open. That's good. Because that joker is a chore. Uh, what do I got to do here? Do that. Okay. Got to get that hydraulic cylinder to retract. And I've got to look around and figure out how because I don't remember oh not that dang <laughs> here we go over here bucket lock there it goes I'd say she's off <laughs> all right
right, she's all loaded up and tied down. We got some cross chains on the front. Two points of contact in the rear. Whew, I'm sweating, we're gone. And some of y'all got mad at me because I blocked restaurant access. Huh. <laughs> Sometimes you gotta park it where you can park it. Well, that went easy enough. Get some of this dirt off of here. I really don't want that lime rock in there, but can't help it now. That's my fault. How'd we do? Yeah. Little off. Even after I made an adjustment. Dang. Yeah, not too bad. We're gonna ride with it. Well, we're in a tight spot here, folks. Before we detach, we're gonna unchain and everything. We gotta pull the truck out there. That's all the room we've got. So we gotta pull the truck in in the way so we'll get everything undone and then do that last let's go all right we're all pulled apart now it's time to unload delivered not quite not quite not quite now it's delivered let's get the heck out of here before somebody runs into my beautiful brand new painted KW all right we're pulling off this job site get in there we got to go through this little plaza show y'all something up here stand by all right this right here is Cobb movie theaters which that's not what I'm showing you right beside it see that ice cream shop Carmen's that is my my son's in-laws ice cream shop and she makes 100% homemade ice cream and it's phenomenal. She gets the fruit and does whatever she does and she makes ice cream. So if you're ever in Winter Haven, Florida, find Cobb Theater and try out the ice cream right next door. Well, we got her all detached. We got a long walk. We gotta go way over there and get that off-road truck. It's a good thing we need the exercise. We gotta be real careful. Gotta be real careful rehooking. We can't afford to spin any. That's a big heavy machine and we are sitting on top of sugar sand. So but this truck pulls a lot better than the than the Mac. So pretty confident. We 
Well, that's her. It's a 40 ton. I think the last one we hauled was a 55, so should be a little bit smaller. Get in here and figure this thing out. Keys in it. Alright, that didn't do anything. That did, oh, the code. There's a code. Enter code. There we go. Let's try this again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do I need to enter the code? Now it's not telling me anything about a code. Huh. I don't know. It worked. Back sensor. Got a glass breaker. Let's see, this is the brake. Yep, she's in drive. What is that? Doors open. What does it matter? Big old rascal. I'm just going to have to guess. Get out and look. gone. I can't see any part of it. Oh, I just bumped the fenders. Let's uh, set the brake. Brake is set. This thing is just as big as the last one. Wow, that front tire is barely on. Wood's gone. I gotta back this thing off and I don't know what I need to do. I need to think. All right, we got it set a lot better. 
we moved it over some we know how troublesome these how close this was how much trouble these were last time we're gonna go ahead and get these hooks on now then we'll attach then we'll finish chaining it down let's go all right we got our hook it was not easy we spun just a little but not bad at all so we're hooked i think we're good Alrighty, we got four flags down each side two chains there pulling to the rear these two cross chains pulling slightly to the rear just like the last one we did same thing across here four flags got a good pull there got these cross chained pretty well flat if you remember the last one the tires i had to shut the these were leaning against the tire so it is a little bit smaller and that's a good thing <laughs> all right we got our differentials locked Whew. it's time to see if this baby's gonna pull come on girlfriend detached now we got to get it unchained unloaded got a flat tire on the way here and uh we still got another move to make our yard isn't far from here so i think uh -oh. we're just going to go to the yard <laughs> go to the yard switch trucks and go make that last move. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay, we got that. get the last one for the day as you can see I decided not to go to the yard and switch trucks it's already close to five o'clock in the afternoon and they have to have this machine tomorrow early so we had to run basically through two towns to get here so it's not like we were running 60 70 mile an hour down the road barely got it above 50 just for a short spell that tire's already gotten so hot it's ruined so we're just gonna get this machine get it moved well they don't have the buckets the way they're supposed to be they got the small bucket on it's supposed to have the big bucket on because the small bucket fits inside it this particular machine i do not know how to switch that bucket because they got to take this piece of rebar and do something with it i don't know but we're not going to switch it i know that we're gonna figure out a way to grab that other bucket 
and make it work. Yep. No! Hold still, Nelly. Hold still. Come on, baby. Work with me. I ain't got time. of the day looks like me and you gonna get to see the sunset together won't well, that be special better turn some flashing lights on look all the people over there eating making me jealous all I had was a handful of peanut butter pretzels today I am ready all right, she's pulled apart. All we gotta do is just not get run over. folks it was a long day i'm gonna make this short because i don't even think you can see me but appreciate y'all hanging out and we will catch you again on the next one